Now to our GMA cover story. Beyonce's highly anticipated country album dropping overnight, of course, and Cowboy Carter. Oh, you know, it's already lassoing up rave reviews. Oh, Stephanie see. Ramos. <laughs> you like that, didn't you? <laughs> hey, Stephanie, you got the reaction. Uh, incredible collaborations, huh? Yes, so many. I love it when story prep includes listening to Beyonce all morning long. I'll take it. Cowboy Carter has officially arrived. This much anticipated follow up to her album Renaissance and her 2016 album Lemonade, both of which infused art and symbolism into her music. Beyonce's new album, Cowboy Carter, which is her eighth, marks her official entry into the world of country music. Hello, girls. Hello, Beyonce. Hello. Saddle up. Cowboy Carter is finally here. We want to welcome you to the Beyonce Cowboy Carter Act 2 in a rodeo chilling circuit. And the beehive is buzzing. A Beyonce album. This is not a country album. She said it and she meant it. With a whopping 27 tracks and star studded collaborations like Miley Cyrus. Yeah, I'll be your bestie, baby. I'm driving you crazy. Interludes with country mainstays like Willie Nelson. You know my name? No need to know yours. Linda Martell, the first commercially successful black female artist in country music. Ladies and gentlemen, this particular tune stretches across a range of genres. And the one and only Dolly Parton. Hey, Miss Honeybee, it's Dolly P. Leading into a barn burning cover of the country queen's hit, Jolene. Jolene, 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 Jolene. I'm wanting you, woman, find you your own man. Beyonce warming hearts with a feature from her own daughter, Rumi, on the endearing protector. Mom, can I meet you? The war bye, bye please. And a new spin on the Beatles classic Blackbird, featuring country newcomers Britney Spencer, Tiara Kennedy, Raina Roberts, and Tanner Adele. Blackbird fly. Blackbird fly. Into the light of a dark black night. Our Janae Norman recently sitting down with Adele. I've been knocking, banging, kicking on this door, and Beyonce really opened it. I don't know if it changes that kind of systematic gatekeeping of yeah. country music, but it does change who feels empowered to be there and show up and listen. This is Beyonce's first country album, a genre she says she initially didn't feel welcomed in. Texas Hold'em, topping the charts. The 32-time Grammy winner, the first black woman to reach number one on the country charts. She really is staking her claim and also bringing an entire new audience to an art form. She sure is. Mm. This ain't Texas. Woo! Yes! <laughs> we it. Texas Hold'em. Nice work, guys. This is GMA. <laughs> this is GMA. <laughs> Cowboy Carter took five years to produce. She says she was initially going to put it out during the pandemic, but the world, it was just too heavy at that time. So she took her time mm -hmm. and it, here it is. It's oh. arrived. You can see more of Beyonce's journey into country music on Impact by Nightline's episode. It's Beyonce Country now streaming on Hulu, guys. Thank mm -hmm. you for doing all that hard work for us. <laughs> we really appreciate it. Anytime. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.